Now to our coronavirus coverage and a live look at the state capitol on the left and the Stockton waterfront there on the right. And we are now less than an hour away from the state's indoor mask mandate ending for those who are vaccinated. This is news a lot of people have been waiting for. It's uh, like a sign of relief because I just kind of want everything to go back to normal again like it used to be. Well, most people agree this is positive news. Many say they still plan to keep wearing a mask even if it's not required. Case Area 3's Brittany Hope joins us right now. She's at the state capitol with the latest. Brittany. Yeah, so if you're a parent, remember your child will still have to wear a mask at school as well as their teachers. And yes, if you were unvaccinated per state law, you still have to mask up indoors. Tonight we went over to Stockton to talk to business owners there to see what changes they'll make, if any, when they go to open their doors tomorrow morning. Stockton's Miracle Mile seeing lines of cars, walkers and outdoor diners on the eve of the state's mask mandate going away for most. I feel like it's a relief. So I'll continue to wear it. People are split. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm probably going to keep mine on, honestly. Mask on or mask off. One shopper said her decision is made. I really like wearing my masks. I'm going to continue to do it whether there's a mandate or not. Inside Majestic Barbershop, opinions are different from chair to chair. You know what, I'm vaccinated and boosted and so I've been ready to go since last March <laughs> without these. But he's cautious for others. I think it's really important that we still keep them in schools and we still keep the safety protocols in schools. Concerned for the health of little ones like seven-year-old Thiago. The teacher told them that we'll finally get the results in two weeks if we don't have to wear these anymore. So I really hope these go away. Dad says exposures at his son's school are increasing. His son is vaccinated. I feel like it's a good idea for them to keep them on, but I know all the kids mainly don't want to wear them anymore. They're tired of it. The owner of the shop will give his patrons a choice. Us barbers here will probably wear the mask still, but um, if people don't want to wear it, I mean, I don't see why not, you know, but it's kind of what everybody wants to do. A few doors down Pacific Avenue. Delta Awards has a similar take. And I don't, you know, really enforce it, but if people come in and wear it, you know, that's that's totally fine. His trophy business has boomed since kids went back to school and sports were given the green light. These are fantasy football trophies. He hopes demand keeps going up with masks no longer law for people who are vaccinated starting tomorrow. This type of mandate being lifted, I think will kind of make that fear go away. And it is important to note there were plenty of people tonight in Stockton who already weren't wearing their masks indoors, and that's been the case. A lot of us have seen it over the past few weeks and months, and we know viewers have talked to us about that as well. So it is clear, mandate or not, there are some Californians who haven't been masking regardless. We're live in Sacramento. Brittany Hope, KCRA 3 News.